Hello, this is Grandma's Gone Gaming. I'm bringing you episode 3 of my Let's Play of the October 2015 Minecraft Hardcore Challenge by Michael Deering. I have, uh, this is called Enemy Territory, and I have reached the place where we're supposed to build. I have started my garden, and just before I started the uh, tape up again, I filled in this area here with the, with the, um, right, cobblestone. It had dirt. I needed the dirt. So then I've come back here to finish getting the coal. And I'm going to get myself out there. I'm, gonna, I'm leaving that uh, daylight going a little bit because it is dark in this little valley. And I have to get out there and get some more light going. I got the coal. I need to get that wood that's out there too. So I'm going to shoot for that. I don't hear anything out here. I think possibly there's an Enderman. Oh, I was going to go out this way. That's what I was going to do. Yep, Enderman flitting around. I think I can avoid looking at him. And I don't want the chickens to come back in. Yeah, I think I don't have enough wood to do it. Maybe I do. Maybe. Right. Stay. All right, door, quick. Quick, 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 doors. Okay, five. I get a door set up here. Hopefully nothing's going to come behind me. Keep my eyes down. I'll fix that door a little bit later on. I think I just must be right around to where that that uh, cave starts over there. Hope oh, there's an, another Enderman over there. They do tend to travel in twos. So I don't mind them being out here as long as I don't... Uh, have to run and hide because my ceilings are too high in there. Let that go down. I don't want to attract any other stuff. I don't know what's going to be over there. Okay, he's got a piece of dirt that he's carrying around. Looks like the other one does too. I see another dirt um, block flying in the air over there. That always looks so funny when you can't see them. Okay, at least I have wood. Right over there, I hear him. It sounds like turkeys out there. Gobble, gobble. Okay. And there's a hole there. Uh, yeah. Alright. Throw some more light out here, I think. Okay. I just want to take a look around over here. Oh, big waterfall. And there's another tree, and I hear zombies. I don't want to be caught with my back to them. I don't mind killing them. I just don't want to be caught with my back to him, and I really don't want creepers. There's a skeleton. I don't have a lot of health, so I'm not going to stick my nose out here for real long. I needed the uh, wood more than anything, so I got that. Yeah, here comes the skeleton over this way, but he can't get in. Now, the, the um, zombies, however, we are in hardcore. So I think I'll put a block in front of that door in case they beat my door down. All right. And I'll fix that later on. Oh, I got an apple. Yay. I didn't think I did. I need to go out and let's see if I can get a little more of that out there too, actually. See if there's any more saplings. I need to plant some. Okay, now as long as that skeleton's over here, I can go ahead and get him. I'm going to get saplings into this area. Get my sword ready. I don't want to go down in a hole there. All right, there we go. I do not want to ride that down. I don't think anything's going to be coming out of there because the water's going down. There's another apple. Yay. And another sapling. And I've got some saplings over here. Don't see any creepers coming out of there yet anyway. That kind of surprises me. As dark as it is. Uh, okay. You know, I think I'm going to shut this one off because that's a small hole. And I can do that. And then I don't have to be worried about that one. And then I, I can investigate that when I have time. 
can't shut this one off. But, oh, I got a bone. Yay. <sighs> Alright, I'm out of torches. Darn it. Okay, while I'm out here, I'll go ahead and cut this down a little bit out here. Then my door should be safe. I can operate on it a little bit more, put some cobblestone underneath it at some point, but I this is only temporary anyway. I had two of those, yay! All right then. Okay. Um, still didn't get the trees replanted, and I need to do that. Yeah. yeah I'm gonna go ahead and eat it. Okay. Now that, and I can go ahead and make some sticks now. And make some more torches. Okay. Now, go ahead and get out here again. I see another area that I should probably close off. Okay, we're going to go ahead and get this guy. I don't want to get over there too much, but I can take him out easily. And here comes another one. Unless I get a real siege, I'm good to go. Down you go. Okay. Alright, that's good. And again, I don't know. It looks like there is some sort of a cavern up there. So I probably should be a little careful about that. But I think I'm going to get these trees planted here. Alright, it's supposed to be build my house on the 78 layer, which is this layer. So I'm going to end up probably building the house. You know, I have to get over here to minus 92, which is this way. I, I'm assuming that's like the center of our house. 92, 78, minus 187, which would be right here. Alright, so this is the center of the house, right here. Marking that that in there. Um, there we go. Okay. So that way I know where I can build and where I can't build. And this is all this was. Oh, it looked so, so like such a vast cavern over here. <laughs> okay. Well, that's better than what I thought. I need to get a, jump up and get a, like a torch up there maybe. And another one up. Come on, I can reach that one. No? Okay, there we go. Alright, so then, although there could be a few things maybe spawn up there, it's not going to be quite so bad. And this, I'm not sure if this goes back anywhere. No, it doesn't. So I can also jump up and put a torch up there. And I don't know about that. No, it's just straight up, I think. So, now there's this area over here, and there's also a tree over there, but I think I'd rather get my trees planted here first. Water's keeping everything down in that one. Like I said, this is center of the house, so I don't really have to fill all this in, I don't think. I can, I can fill in a little bit. Um, it's going to get dark here again. And then have my porch looking out over a lower area perhaps and maybe I can feed some of that waterfall in that way over into here to make a little fishing pond maybe and we'll see what I can do. Um, this one here I need to get some more light over here too. This one will just feed my garden and I'll probably just keep it going on down that way. And right now I certainly don't want to stop stop it going because that's keeping anything from coming up. Okay. There we go. The only thing I'm a little concerned about now is this one over here. Okay. Um, 
get a little bit more light up there. I, I'm just not sure if that's actually a cavern area up there. And if it is, there could be things spawning up there that would drop down. But I don't think I'm going to be too worried about much of anything right now. I should be able to have a pretty good time out here building. And then I can go down into the mine area and uh, I think that's good. You know, I think I'll take this right now. Fill these in here. Put the door back up. I still didn't plant my trees. I get sidetracked so easily. Silly person. Trees, trees, trees. And five. So at least this is a little better out here now. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and plant my trees down here, I think. One, two, three, four. How many does that haul me? And I also have some spruce. So I'm going to go ahead and plant them the same way. And I have a better chance of getting some more apples off of the oak planted that way. And the, the uh, spruce trees always grow better in fours. So there we go. Okay. Now how are we doing? Oh, yay. Look at that. Even without using the bone meal that I had, I have one wheat. And I will go ahead and use, I didn't, yeah, I did get seed, okay. Use the bone meal that I have here on that one. I have one more bone meal. No, I don't need that more than that. Okay. There we go. There, all right then. And that takes care of all my bone meal. Uh, wait, make sure that they're good and established. And now I have two wheat. I can make some bread. And Okay, all I needed was one more to get two loaves of bread, but I can make one. All right. Don't need it yet. I'm going to go ahead and fill in this other row here. Okay. Okay, I've got to watch for day four coming up. But I think I feel like I've got a much better start on this than I did in the Little House series. Although I'm still feeling nervous about this one. This is only my second time doing this, and it's only my... F whew, that's where the hole starts. It's only my first official one. All you other players have been doing this for a while. Okay, I don't want to shut that off. I just want to fill this in here and then work my way down on the far side of this. And see what I can find. Because I might as well use the time. Six. Okay, here we go. Going on down. Down here. Okay. Okay. Take this bottom row off here. Okay, so I can go ahead and fill that in also. There we go. See what I can find down here. Now this feels much more normal to me than when I can't kill the monsters. So I don't have to worry about it. I have two wooden swords, which are not the best implements yet, but I'll get better. Get some better ones. And we are up at layer 71 here in this area. So I'm not going to get like any precious metals right here. But we'll see what I can find. Dirt in there? More dirt? Hmm. Okay. Don't want to put my torches down there, because if I misguide that water, then I'll put all my torches out. So 
So there's one over there, and one going down this way. And with the water running, it's real hard to tell if I'm hearing a skeleton or not. really coming down there. I kind of didn't expect, expect it to be going quite this far in. Six. Can we get around this corner here, I think. And it turns there. Whoops. Okay, there it goes in there. Okay. Goodness sakes. <sighs> Gotta watch my time. I keep forgetting to watch that time more closely. And I keep running into my next day. Okay, let's do this. Let's block that off there. And I think then I'll just do what I, I have 10 torches. So I can kind of run in here a little bit. I usually go a lot faster, but I I'm trying to spread my torches out. Oh boy, one of these. This ought to be fun. I think you can get up here. So let's, I have three left. And am I coming to the end for now? I am. Okay, that's good. So this is giving me some more coal. And I hear the music going, which tells me there's just a minute or two probably left. I think it's supposed to come on, what is it? 60 seconds or 30 seconds before the time changes. Still saying day three, but the sun must be coming up. Let's see if I can get all this out of here before I have to stop. And that's the last of my pickaxe. And the time is about ready to change. And no more torches. All right, I think I'll pick that one up. And where did it go? Come on, I know I picked it up. I'm not, oh, gee, okay, one, duh. Still says day three. Oh, jeez, it is day three. I'm, no, that's right, okay. <laughs> I thought for a minute, man, I've gone way over. No, I am looking for day four to come up. Okay. I can just go on up this way. Because even if something comes out of here, I can go up and they can't. I mean, they can, but not very fast. Okay, I will block this off. Until next time, and I can put a door in there. I have one, but I just don't want to take the time to do it. Okay, well, I'm down two hunger bars again. But I'm okay. I still have some uh, zombie flesh there. I have my bread. I won't eat the bread until I get down three hunger bars. And day four, so I will see you in the next episode.